Okay, CDC Emerger. It's exactly the same as the Possum Emerger, only we're substituting the Possum for CDC. A lot of people don't like it because as someone just said, it gets wet, gunky, but I love it. It's a good fish catcher and it, and it seems to catch and floats well. So, okay, we're using a B170-12. I only use one piece of CDC for the tail, stroke it all back. Now the method's very similar to what the last fly was, as far as the dubbing concerns of it went. Only this one I'm, I'm more inclined to tie it with a tighter body than I am the, the possum one. Can I get you to move your hand, please? Thank you. Okay. Right, Jim? Yep, you're right. Right, nice little... I don't put a big body on this one at all, because usually the lighter coloured duns are a very small... two CDC feathers married together, place them on top of the hook, not too tight, you still do it that way? No, do now. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. That just helps it to stand up by putting those couple of turns in the back edge of it there. Just shorten the wing just a little bit. There it is. So you don't try and dry them off with your desiccant or anything like that. You just cut it off and pop pop it on your patch and Do give it a wash. Give it a wash. Mm. I might try and get away with. If the fish are going bonkers, mm. I sometimes get away using it twice. Yep. But um, you know, depending on where the fish has got it. Mm. But you know, time after time, you'll go there, and you'll, you'll particularly on penstock, you'll find little light, little yeah. light grey duns. Yeah. Mm. Next time, or oh, well, even in the same day, next thing you know, the, the big brown. Boys are out, you know. Mm, mm. Okay. It's 
So would that be better in a 14, would it? No, I have just as much success with it with the 12. I time in 12s and 14s, yeah, okay. but it's, the 12 is quite good. So, look, yeah, the, the Duns are quite a reasonable size.